Hi, this is Jody King Colgrove with Quantum Techniques. We have a proven technique to quickly determine the root cause of your health issue using a form of energy medicine. I work with people all over the world, helping them determine why they're having a health issue and what they can do about it. And I do it over the phone. So what I wanted to share with you today is a great morning routine that will help you keep centered. And this does come from um, Donna Eden, which I have, um, it's interesting, I've, I've done it you know, since she taught it to me, and I really found that it does help center me. So I wanted to share it with you, um, kind of with the quantum technique um, bend in it. Um, so I usually do mine in the shower because I just find that in the shower that you're kind of like, you're throwing off you know, everything you've come in contact with for the last 24 hours and then you're putting on new. So that's kind of why I do it. So um, I gotta remember how I do it. Okay, so you do the, the thumps on the chest, okay? Then you do the thymus tap and for spleen and thymus, okay? And I hope I can show this. So then what you do is you touch one knee, okay, to one elbow, you touch the other knee to the elbow, and yes, I don't fall in the shower because, okay, so I do that about three times, I would say, okay? And then what I do is I, what they call the cross crawl. So you take this hand and, and hit this knee. So you're going across the body. And that, so one is linear and the other one is cross. Okay, so I do that about three times. Then what I do is I still take my arm, but then I'm kicking, okay? Hope you can see that, okay? So then you kick the next one, you kick the next one. Okay, so I do that about three times, okay? Um, then what I found is that I touch the third eye and then I touch the navel, okay? And I'm pulling up on both of those and I'm just kind of breathing, okay? I do that about three times. And then I also take t my two thumbs and I put them kind of right in the creases, you know, right where the eyes, and I just kind of do a prayer position. And again, just breathing, especially at this one, try to really breathe into the um, diaphragm, and it's okay, women, to let your stomach out. <laughs> no one's watching. Okay, and then really, and, and then kind of push out the air too. So you're, okay. And I do that about three times. Then what I do is I take my hands here, and I reach up to the sky, and then down to the feet on the other one. And so it's what you're doing is you're connecting the top half of your body and the left the bottom half of your body. So I do those about three times or two times on either side. Okay? Then I do the infinity wave, okay? And I do that where I go down to my feet. So I'm going all the way down and up and up to the air and then down again. And just do that, you know, two or three times, okay? Then what I do is that that's making my energy alive. And then I want to do, I want to protect my energy. So I'm going to take, and I'm going to, with, a lot of times what I do is I build the cloud and um, like my energy around me. So I go start my feet and I just kind of, I'm building the energy cloud around me as my protection. I think about God being in that cloud for me that day, okay? Then what I do is I'm going to zip up my energy, and we I have several videos on that. So I just think about um, my energy coming up through my back, and reach back as far as I can, and pulling it up to my upper lip, and then zipping it up the front to my bottom lip. And I'm the only one that's allowed to give my energy away. So I think of it as kind of a key that I'm holding. Okay. <clears throat> now, I have found it very profound, but that's kind of the, the dance per se. Um, but I have found it profound to also come up with an affirmation that's my purpose, okay? Um, and so that may be different for all of us, obviously. And so I say what my purpose is, okay? And I actually cross my heart and ask the Holy Spirit to come into my, my life that day and to, for me to help my clients and to help those I come in contact with. So um, it says, I choose to view the world as a wonderful place of joy, beauty, and love. Okay, and that's my affirmation. And it goes on from there. Then what I do is I think about 
as I'm doing that cloud that I was talking about, I think about the people in life. So I choose to view, um, I'm sorry, it's hard to, when you're doing it slow like this to know what the, it is, but um, so I choose to send out love to the people in life, my mom, my dad, and I choose to make, and my husband and my dog and my kid, and, um, and then I'm also choosing to be the best mom, wife, daughter um, that I can be. And so I'm wrapping that all up into that affirmation. So just kind of give you some food for thought on how to kind of help you have a good morning routine that builds up your energy. Um, there's lots of different ones out there that I think are very beneficial. Um, so I just kind of wanted to share with you uh, mine today. So um, <clears throat> we also have lots of videos on our YouTube channel for both Quantum Techniques and my personal. And it's a lot about learning and what kind of things we do at Quantum Techniques to help with health and happiness. And so you can visit uh, quantumtechniques.com and learn more about what we do with muscle testing and helping your energy and helping you heal some of those big things. And what we find, what we do at Quantum Techniques is we're identifying pathogens, toxins, heavy metals that are impacting your body and not allowing it to heal. And what we, once we've identified it to the body, then it can see it and what it can see, it can heal. So that's what we do at Quantum Techniques and I look forward to working with you. So blessings.